Now, the question coming into this season, kind of like it was a couple years ago in 2018, can HD regain the throne again? This HD team is going to be one of the different teams we haven't seen in a, I don't know, ever. Yeah, yeah, I agree. But if you're saying you're going to count HD out, I believe that you're crazy. Yeah. I mean, HD has won, what, 15 championships? 16, I believe. 16, 16. Okay, I'm sorry. Don't, what's it, you know, <laughs> don't attack me. I was going to say, you know, you know they get on something. You know, how to, you know. <laughs> but, okay, 16 championships, and they've been around since 72, mm-hmm. I want to say. Wilson has been winning for ever, literally. So I'm not saying literally. like I'm not saying they can't make the turkey bowl or anything like that, but it's to the point where if you're not saying they're a threat, you're crazy. Yeah. Um, you know when you're saying they don't have playmakers, you're crazy. Right. So I, I believe it's just one of them things. You just got to figure out what, what, what they're going to bring back to the table and what they're going to. What, what came off the JV? What was in the building and didn't come? What What is the transfer or? Who was that? It's one of those things like that. But one thing we do know, Kayvon Sneed will be on that field. Yes. And 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 I'm glad you t- I'm glad you talked about Kayvon. I'm gonna make a bold prediction real quick. Okay. I believe that Kayvon Sneed will lead the league in rushing this year. As a sophomore. Because I think he'll be their biggest offensive weapon coming into this season. Um if Coach Fuller and that offensive staff are able to put a good old line in front of him, I think he'll lead the league in rushing. And I think 13, 1400 yard type of season, because um, he showed a lot of great glimpses. I can, I can if he gets that. the carries, if he gets the carries I, and the opportunities, I think he can do that. I think he can carry that offense. I can see that. And also, um, last last season when they played against Royalty. Um, Institute. Mm-hmm. I was um, standing with Mike Salahuddin, mm-hmm. former MVP. Yep. Yep. And he was just so amazed. He's like, he seen. He said he seen him like on Instagram before mm-hmm. and, and youth ball. But he was like seeing him in person playing. He's like, it's crazy how good he is. Wow. And he said he wanted to work with him. Wow. Man, now of course Salahuddin's transitioned to defensive back, but I'm pretty sure he can. He ain't for, some, yeah, he, he ain't forgot. He ain't forgot you nothing. Know what I'm <laughs> he can show him some tips, but also. DeAndre Purs with HD Wilson, I coached mm-hmm. against him when he was in middle school and he was I think on the team he was just a lost um guy in the in the circle of um, running backs that they have. Mm-hmm. But found his way doing um league play. Mm-hmm. I think HD was playing like five, six running backs at the time. Yeah. But now, you know, graduation. So I believe him him and um K can be a one two punch and right. he he had one play against Wilson. That I saw, he just literally simple handle broke it. Wow, I mean untouched. Mm, he can do it. Yeah, so it's, I I want to see that. That's what I want to see. Those two, um, and I I just want to see great football. Yep, yep. And I think and and we know HD will give us that. Um, and and coming into this season, like I said, I believe that uh, Snead will be their biggest offensive weapon. Mm-hmm. Um, but I think for HD. Um, and like you mentioned, the uh, Life After Sports show that I did with the 2010 team, um, talking about a great defense. Mm-hmm. I believe for HD, the motto will be defense wins championships. Um, and a couple players I believe, um, returning players who I believe make an impact. Number one, um, strong safety Josiah Young. Show promise, um, should make an impact, especially in a Coach Brandon Dow defense. Um, whether in the box or in coverage, made some really good plays last year. Um, so if he's able to kind of do some of the things he did last year, if not more so, um, I think he'll be fine. Um, now coming into, and also I believe Brandon Williams will be another one um, who I think will make an impact. Maybe not as well known as Young, kind of flew under the radar on a defense who, you know, Got a lot of pieces. Right, you know, right, like like Keyshawn and et cetera. Um, but one thing about watching his tape, he plays the ball well and has good instincts. Yeah. See, when I'm when I'm um, looking at HD, I'm looking at who's going to be the next DB. Yeah. Who's that next def- um, defensive back? Because we can go on, like, back years forever and, and just and each years. year. Yeah. So I want to know who's that defensive back. I mean, for a while they've been running number two. Right. I don't know what's going to happen, you know. That's what I want to see, who's. Who's going to be that person to step up in that role? All right, right. And I think um, for HD, um, that question will be answered when the season comes. Right now, we don't know. Um, and I'm not even sure if they know. But um, 
Um, for HD, kind of like kind of a different type of feel to the come to, to the program coming into this year. I believe um, only time will tell for them. So also, to be honest, um, you know, there's been talks. What when is it going to be Coach Ford's last year? It's true. That's true. You know, that's uh, is this going to be one of the last years we see him on the sideline? You yeah. never know. Talking about the end of an era. Because yeah. um, seven, if they win the turkey, they win Turkey Bowl fifty one. That'll be eight Turkey Bowl championships for Coach Fuller, um, and he'll tie um, the great Bob Head and the great Craig Jeffries. Um, a three it'll be a three way tie for eight. Wow. So that's maybe he'll walk away with uh, a lot of with, wings. Yeah, that's, that's a, lot a lot of wings. wings. A lot of rings. So maybe he'll lot, walk away with that. If you think about that's a lot of waking up early on Turkey Bowl morning. Yep. 